On the morning after the Senate's overwhelming approval of the bailout bill, protests here on Capitol Hill. This as House leaders do everything they can to try to win the dozen or so votes they'll need to win House approval of the measure. There are two provisions that the Senate added which could make a big difference. The first, more than $100 billion worth of tax cuts, and the second, a more than doubling of the federal deposit insurance program. Now, some lawmakers who voted against the program the first time around have now indicated they are leaning towards supporting it. However, Democratic leaders are concerned that the tax cuts that are in the bill might actually cost them the votes of some conservative Democrats, known as blue dogs, who normally oppose such a provision without some offsets. However, at last check, they appear willing to go along with the tax cuts because of the dire economic situation the country is in. President Bush, meanwhile, is weighing in, saying the Senate bill is exactly what the House needs to pass. He calls it especially important for all Americans, saying it's essential to their economic future. A lot of people are watching the House of Representatives now to determine whether or not they uh, will be able to act positively on a bill that has been uh, improved. But after Monday's stunning defeat, the House leadership is making sure they have the votes needed to pass the measure before they even bring it up for consideration. Jerry Bodlander, The Associated Press, Capitol Hill.